Hello guys, in today's video, we're going to present to you the top 9 soundbar for Hisense available on the market today. We made this list on our personal preferences and sorted it based on the features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers. Check out the description to find out their prices and more information. We've included the links in the description below. If you're first time on our channel, please subscribe and hit the bell button for the daily video notification. So, without further ado, let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have Bose Solo 5. Bose is a brand that you can trust to manufacture sound systems that are of high quality and that give pure listening pleasure. Solo 5 is a new offering in the market with an affordable price tag and a range of incredible features. Unboxing the Solo 5, the first thing you will see is that it sports a pretty solid build with a sleek design. Although the cabinet is made of plastic, it still looks premium as the curved edges and matte black finish harmonize together to give an appealing aesthetics. One of the nice features of this audio gear sports is the auto-wake functionality that makes the sound our road to life when it picks a signal. It also has an auto power down feature that kicks in after 60 minutes of an activity, so you don't have to worry about forgetting to turn it off. Moving on to the next at number 2 with Yamaha S207V. Yes Yamaha has been in the business long enough to know that soundbars are meant to be heard and not seen, and this is why the design of their products has never been a priority. Fair enough, if you ask us. Accompanied by two subwoofers in the packaging, the soundbar rocks an inconspicuous design such that it may go completely unnoticed if not for its logo. Easy access touch controls, and a display system of LED set on the front panel. The biggest selling point of the Yaz 207 is DTS Virtual X, a technology that analyzes an incoming audio signal and uses the speakers to simulate a three sound stage, including creating virtual speakers where none exists. Furthermore, there is also a chance to enhance dialogue by pressing the clear voice button on the remote. The number three position is held by Sonos Beam. The Sonos Beam is one of the smallest soundbars from the company. Way smaller than its cousin, the supersized Sonos Play, measuring 650x 100x 68.5M. This device is ideal for those who want a compact sound gear. The controls are positioned on the top and are touch sensitive, comprising the volume buttons, play slash pause button, previous slash next track button, and a button to turn the speaker mic up. You can suspend the soundbar on the wall or let it sit in front of your TV as its 100 depth is perfect and won't block part of the screen. On the rear, you will get an Ethernet, HDMI slot, power, and a Wi-Fi button. As stated earlier, the soundbar comes with an app rather than a remote to perform functions like volume control and link up speakers. The app offers over 60 audio services that are compatible with the Sonos Beam. Next at number 4 we have Sony HD Z9. The HD Z9F measures about a meter long and features a removable grille, which conceals a trio of drivers. Its black matte finish gives it a sleek looking feel. The sub is mainly made of wood, with the port in the back is glossy black while the front is covered with a black mesh fabric which tends to easily get dirty and ripped. On the rear, the connectivity options include an HDMI out with ARC and two HDMI input, which are Fork HDCP and Dolby Vision compatible so you will be able to plug your Blu-ray player and games consoles into it with the HD Z9 if comes with seven sound modes that are suitable for movies, gaming, music, news, and sport, so you can feel the thrill of your favorite shows and movies. For example, the movie mode helps to create cinema-like sounds while the music mode enhances the vividness of songs so you can hear every detail. The number 5 position is held by Zbox EQ Voice AF200. Although the AF200 is actually a soundbar, the company claims it is a TV speaker. And this is probably why it comes with no subwoofer. Measuring 17 inches wide, 3.1 inches deep, and 2.9 inches high. The sound system has an understated but attractive brushed aluminum chassis and a black steel grille. You can wall mount the soundbar using the keyholes in the back or let it sit on a cabinet in front of the TV without worries that it will block off an area of your TV screen. A LED display is positioned in the front of the unit while the right side houses rubberized controls and a base port. The selling point of the AF100 is that it will make TV voices sound clearer and easier to understand, and it delivers impressively well on that promise. The soundbar can decode Dolby Digital soundtracks and its three surround sound modes selectable on the remote that increasingly widens its soundstage. The number 6 position is dominated by Vizio SB3821C6. When it comes to design, 
Vizio soundbars keep things pretty simple, and the SB3821 C6 follows the tradition. Sporting a basic and minimalist style, the entire soundbar is wrapped on all sides in black fabric that acts as a grille. With exception to the edges which come in form of brushed aluminum panels with the logo of the brand on them, due to its basic design and compact design, this soundbar can fit into your living room without drawing attention and will fit into any spot you keep it. Audiophiles will love this soundbar as it comes with deep bass technology that enhances the delivery of room-filling sound with added bass even without a separate subwoofer. It also comes with Dolby Digital Surround Sound which is the audio standard for cinema. Broadcast, DVD, and Blu-ray, providing dramatic spatial dimension to soundtracks. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Hisense HS218 2.1 Soundbox. This Hisense sound system is a great option for your 40-inch TV as the dimensions are 950x63x63 x among Hisense soundbars great for a medium to small entertainment setup. Since they are optimal for small to medium-sized entertainment setups, they are two channels only. You are able to connect to this soundbar as it supports wireless Bluetooth streaming capabilities. Alternatively, it also has optical audio input meaning with an app connector you can directly connect to your device with minimal setup. If you wish to connect using HDMI, that is also available for your convenience with their HDMI ARC feature that allows you to do so. It has a wireless subwoofer built into it with Dolby Digital support. The number 8 position is held by Hisense HS512 Wireless Woofer. This slim soundbar is a great addition to your medium to large surround sound system. It will look great in front of your TV. Granted, it will be a large one at that. It also has a wireless external subwoofer for bass. As the name implies, it is a 5.1 dual channel system. It also has an HDMI connector, which lets you to stream fork and HDR material. Assuming your TV is fork capable to begin with, so that's a nice feature to have. Along with the other front-firing woofers, it contains two up-firing drivers, delivering clear mids and highs all around. Finally, the number 9 position is dominated by Hisense HS205 2.0 Channel Sound. The HS205 Dual Channel Soundbar is a great budget option for you if you're looking to trim some cash from your budget without compromising much for a big screen. This speaker is a perfect fit for anything that is above 32. Granted, you are not getting an external subwoofer, alongside the Bluetooth and easy wired connection. It is able to be remote controlled, giving you full convenience. The Bluetooth technology has been made easy to connect to any laptop, tablet, or smartphone. It is compact and elegant with a built-in subwoofer so no worries of fitting a larger sub. That's all for today. We upload tech product review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.